yeah, before I met um, before I met Balance View and before I did the Twelve Empowerments, I would say that um, just life felt like a struggle, and um, I was. I just felt confused by a lot of things. I was living in London, I was working in TV and film, I was going to these amazing places, amazing music, and it seemed like everything was just there. It was like, why, why is there, why am I not feeling like my life is clicked and, and complete? And I really wanted to understand why I was so driven to find something other than what was seemingly perfect in my life. Everything was all, all in place. And um, so a lot of my drive was to really understand what, um, why I felt so driven to find something else, if that makes sense. And um, so all of that searching and testing and trying out different things led me to the conclusion that there's just something wrong with me. There's something wrong with me feeling negative, thinking negatively, and just being who I am in situations where I thought all I had to do was just be positive and good. And, and I just could not get that. There was just this, this struggle between those two. And it just felt like, I can't believe my life will be like this. I, I cannot, I, I just cannot this cannot be my life oh. and uh, you know so the 12 empowerments just brought me to a place where I could just see this so clearly and through a friend I could see the results um, the changes in her and the magnetism to see the way that she responded to me and my negativity that there was this suddenly, for the first time, being with somebody who had just completed the 12 empowerments, I suddenly felt like there was this space had opened up and I wanted to know what that was. And so I, 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 was, I am doing that, I want to do the empowerments. So I did everything I could to make that possible and uh, during the empowerments was just the most incredible couple of weeks of my life it, the you know I mean a couple of key things really was the um, sense of connection with other people that I felt from my heart beyond even getting to know them in a conventional way like I didn't need to go through any kind of background of who they were and what they were and yet I could not believe how close and intimate I felt with people who I just met I, I found it completely amazing and all of the um, the life before feeling so isolated and feeling so like um, this is just me, maybe this is just me. Suddenly I'm in the empowerments and everyone's experiencing the same thing and everyone completely understands what I thought was my secret life in my head or you know, my own personal drive for life and suddenly I'm listening to everyone <laughs> and, every, and it's just like, oh my goodness, this is amazing. This is way more than just my own, you know, personal project. And, um, and all, what, I f what I really love about the 12 Empowerments is just the safety of the space to bring up anything. And all of those, you know, the thoughts that you just think, oh, this is so bad, like, I just cannot think this. This is, this is not allowed either about the teaching or about the people or about my family or about relationships or whatever. I'm just not allowed to think these things. And just writing it down and just sharing it so simply and being supported to see that there's nothing wrong with any of that at all. And the release of that just freed up so much energy and so much time and so much clarity in my own experience to see where I'd been focusing and, you know, getting lost in trying to work all of this out. What's my life? How am I doing? What's going to happen? What's the plan? What's the life plan here? And whoa, I just like completely missed life was happening right there in front of me. And um, so I saw very quickly how my relationships improved because I then started with my family. I then turned up with the um, 
complete power to contribute to a situation, it never even occurred to me. And that just is so sad to live for 35 years in a, in a family relationship where I never even occurred to me that I could actually contribute to a, to a relationship. And the, the sense of love and just, oh, gratitude to just be able to do that um, just exploded in my life and I just, you know, it just changed everything in my relationships from going from being somebody who was just very argumentative and very angry um, at my parents, at my brothers all the time, picking at them, you know, about everything. And um, suddenly I'm just more available for them. And um, yeah, I just, I find that completely incredible. Um, and then I see now the, um, everything just opens up. Everything just becomes so much easier just through the process of training. I always thought open intelligence was some obscure thing that, you know, maybe if I do a few things, then maybe I'll glimpse it once or a couple of times. And actually, that if, if, to see that it's a systematic training process that can come alive in my own experience in the same way that everybody sat in the room can come alive in theirs, that's incredible. And I find that to be very powerful and very safe, that it's actually possible to train up in the recognition of open intelligence and live that as a daily experience. And so everything that we do here together only supports that and fuels that. And it is an amazing life. I feel so enriched every day to have that as my focus and have that as my uh, my context for everything that happens. Everything just becomes such a, a wonderful learning experience. It's it's just so beautiful and just to share it all together is you know, it's it's incredible. So yeah, thank you all so much. It's just been wonderful to be here doing the setup with you and just doing the next season ahead. So.